So let's do a quick teardown of the Unity UT81D+, the 3-in-1 meter. I already made a full review of it, so feel free to check it out. I've been using it for two weeks and have already fixed a bunch of stuff. Overall, I kind of like this meter, but once you look inside, it feels like a ripoff. So let's get into it. Let's remove the battery cover, which exposes to 18650 cells, rated at 2600 mAh, which is very cool. You can easily replace them or upgrade to a higher capacity. Now let's remove the back cover and take a look inside. Does it look nice to you? For me, it doesn't. Especially considering I have tons of Unity devices and they all look perfectly engineered inside. Now take a look over here. It's a total mess. This is not what you expect from any reputable brand. It looks like they missed something in the original design and had to improvise southern components on top of others. Also, the input protection circuit is as simple as it can get. Look at this Unity 181, for example. That's how it should have looked. Some components aren't soldered properly. And look at how they soldered this terminal. What's that? Let's remove the board. It looks decent. These chips handle all the heavy operations. No heatsinks here, and these two get really hot. So, they definitely cut a lot of corners here. It really feels like a generic product made by some random Chinese company and rebranded by different brands. And I found meters from Owen and Henmatic that look pretty much the same, but way cheaper. Well, I guess that's how some companies do business now. Would I recommend this device? It's definitely better in my opinion than FNIRC or similar devices, but it's not perfect. Even though it does its job pretty well, I don't know how long will it last. So listen to your gut on this one.